got bored of sitting in the blind. So we're going to go do some running and gunning. Running and gunning. If you guys don't know what that is, it's just, instead of turkeys coming to find us, we go and find them. So. Okay guys, we're at the top of the hill. At the top of the hill. Uh, we're just running and gunning. Haven't heard nothing but geese. So. Maybe we'll get something up on top here. up on top here. So there might be yeah there might be a Tom over the corner. Those hens, they ended up, they didn't really see us. They just knew something was up. Uh, I just belly crawled up there and put my decoy up there. And they're out there in those fields out there. So, I think there might be, because there's a bull, and I think there might be a, some toms on the other side, I don't know. But, that's what running and gunning's all about. Going to the birds. Not them coming to you, so we're gonna pack up and head that way. All we seen, guys, was those top or those hands up there, so we're gonna head back down to the blind. We'll catch back up with you guys when we're there. Okay, guys, we're back in the blind. Uh, I did some just locating calls, didn't have anything, so. Maybe we'll have some luck here in the next, I don't know, hour, two hours, till Dad comes. So Sarah's out there. Don't know what she's doing, so. Well, maybe we can get something, so, yeah.
as chill as possible. You had one heart. Can I do Yeah. Okay, guys. We just figured that there ain't no gold. It's getting pretty late and towards lunchtime, so we're gonna head out. We'll see you tomorrow on day two. Well, I've had some rough times so far. I told you guys I was gonna go fishing. I brought the camera, but not on the boat. I left it in the truck. Then today, I got really lucky. Oh, it was skill on one end and lucky on the other. I went turkey hunting this morning. And brought the camera, but lost my battery on the way out there. Which is a bummer, because I did end up getting one. 26 pounds, 10 and a half inch beard, with an inch and an eighth spurs I think so yeah it was a big one biggest turkey I've ever got is that one the one I shot last year was just a hair smaller so hopefully I don't forget my camera in the truck this time because we're going boating in the same spot we went yesterday which is the spot where we caught seven bass over two and a half pounds and over 15 inches long. Didn't keep any of them because I didn't have a bucket or a cooler. And I just went for fun. So on the other hand, not going to forget the camera is one. And try not to lose the battery. That's a good idea. And charge my batteries for my trolling motor. They kind of got dead last night, so. And then we caught four northern. Them weren't very big. None of them hit over 30 inches. Mine was like 28. We didn't keep those either. But tonight, whatever's legal is in the bucket. So, and then my dad broke my pedestal stool. <sighs> so, then my motor, that bothers me. I'm gonna have to get a new one, getting a mud motor. So, you'll see me doing a lot of butter stuff. So yeah. Fishing today, hopefully. If my dad ever hurries up. It is 3.08. No, I'm not picking my nose. Here, I'll show you a picture of my turkey. Right there. So yeah, he was a big one. Shot him by myself when he was running and in the head. I didn't hit him in the body. So, yeah. This video is going to be uploaded. Either, I think I'm going to start editing tonight. So, yeah. That's all I got until I get out on the water. And when I get out on the water, 
I'll let you guys know. So, 